damn it! Discoloration? No. Then I'm okay. Uh, I'm gonna go get you some ice. Oh no, that's okay. I can't feel things like that. Like what? Oh, uh, like getting hurt. What? I can't feel pain. Oh, jeez, I'm crow. What the hell have I done to you? Nothing. Listen to your talk and loopy going on and, and on about not being able to feel pain. I mean, that's delusional. I've knocked the sense right out of you. No, yet. really, I'm okay. Listen, I was gonna be a nurse, so I know. You're hurt. You just took a good shot to the head, and that's serious. No, oh, I don't think it's serious because, see, ironing boards aren't on my list. What is? Well, I have a list of things that can hurt you and the ironing boards are not on it. it. It's pretty reliable. See, I bet if I took this ironing board and hit you with it, it wouldn't hurt. See? Ow! Ow, what oh. the hell was that? Why did you oh, do that? Oh, did you? I'm, I'm sorry, I didn't think it would hurt because it's not on my list. What are you talking about? Uh, my brother Paul, he's helping me make this list of things that can hurt you and ironing boards are not on it. Well, that ironing board hurt me. Yeah. So you should add it to your list. Yeah. J should I be afraid of ironing boards? Well, if someone swings it at your head and wallops you with it, yes. Well, it's not. I have a list of things that can hurt you, too, and ironing boards are not on this list, either. Well, they shouldn't be, really. No? No, you shouldn't be afraid of ironing boards. No. No. But they can hurt you. Yeah. So I should be afraid of them. No. So I shouldn't be afraid of them. Right. <laughs> but they can hurt me. They're used in the way you used it, yes. Oh, so they're kind of like the opposite of God. What? Well, my brother Paul, <laughs> said, Paul says that God won't hurt me, but I should fear him. And ironing boards can hurt me, but I shouldn't be afraid of them. I guess. Boy, this is getting very complicated. What is? Oh, this business of learning what hurts, what doesn't hurt, what to be afraid of, what not to be afraid of. Um, are you sure you're okay? You're going on and on about crazy stuff. Oh, yeah, I'm fine. I have congenital analgesia. What? It's some congenital analgesia. Who thinks? My brother Paul. Some people call it hereditary sensory neuropathy type 4, but it just means that I can't feel pain. You can hit me with this to see if you want. No. No, go ahead. It won't hurt. See? No. Ow. See? Ow. What? No. No. Come on. No. Come on. No. You're fine. You don't have to hit me. Most people don't. Most people just go away. You can go away too if you want to. My brother Paul says they do that because I scare them, because I tell them about myself. So I've actually recently added myself to the list of things to be afraid of. Oh my gosh, I am so sorry. You hit me. I just closed Most people you. just go away, but you hit me. Well, I had to see, but are you okay? Oh yeah, I don't feel pain. Right, of course you don't feel pain, but are you sure? Well, is there any blood? No. Any discoloration? No. Then I'm okay. Well, there are things that hurt you that make you bleed and bruised, and there are things that hurt you that don't make you bleed and bruised. But it all hurts. I'm Marvel. I'm Steve. I live on the third floor, room 11. I live with my boyfriend, Eric. I love him very much. Yeah, we saw you guys move in. Yeah, our roof collapsed from all the snow in December. We're just here till we get our feet back on the ground. Oh, well, that's good, because Ma Dudley says that our boarding house is for people who need to get their feet back on the ground. Paul says we've been trying to get our feet on the ground the whole lives. Oh. You guys are loud. What? You and Eric, you yell and bang, we're right below you. Oh, um, I'm sorry, we're going through a rough patch happened, sorry. Um, what's it like? What? To not feel pain. I, I don't know, I mean, I don't know what it's like to hurt, so I don't know, I don't really feel. Is this how you were born? Yeah, Paul says it's because I don't have fully developed pain sensors, and they're immature. Well, how does he know that? Oh, he reads. But. And because they're immature, my development as a human being has been retarded. Oh, but, but he teaches me what hurts, though. Why? So I don't ruin myself. I have to know what hurts so I know when to be afraid. My mind can't tell me when to be afraid because my body doesn't know what hurts. So I have to memorize what can hurt. Okay. And I have to memorize what to be afraid of, too. Things like guns and knives and bears and, and fire and uh, fear. I should fear fear itself. <laughs> and pretty girls. Pretty girls? Yeah. Why should you be afraid of pretty girls? 
My brother Paul says they can hurt you because they make you fall in love with them. And that's something else I should be afraid of too. Love. But he says I'm really lucky because I'll probably never have to deal with love because I have a lot of deficiencies and not very many wait, capacities. Wait, what do you mean you're never going to have to deal with love? Oh, Why? because I won't know what it feels like. Well, how does he know that? Because it hurts. <laughs> it shouldn't. Well, plus I have a lot of deficiencies and not very many capacities. You know what? A lot of people do. Oh my gosh, I am so sorry. Um, are, you, are you okay? Well, is there any blood? <laughs> no. Any discoloration? No. Then I'm okay. Yeah, you are. Listen, I'm sorry I did that. It's just, you're really sweet. But you have a boyfriend who you love very much. Yes, I do, and yes, I do. And you just kissed me. Yes, I did. And you're doing your laundry on a Friday night. Yes, I am. People who are in love with each other, they don't do their laundry on Friday nights. I've learned that. People who are in love, they, they go out with each other at the moose patty or dancing or skating, and, and they kiss each other. They don't kiss other people. <laughs> you know what? I don't think that's love, what you and your boyfriend and, have. You know what? I've been down here learning that. I said I'd be, and he doesn't like that. Who? My boyfriend. Who you love very much. Yes. Even though you kissed me. Yes. I'm going to have to tell my brother about no, this. No, don't talk to the Paul about this. No. But I have to learn from him. No, tell, tell him to stop teaching you. Whatever it is he reads, it isn't something you want to know. But... Trust me, I was going to be a nurse, so I know. You need to go see a real doctor and tell your brother to stop reading whatever it is he reads. I have to learn from him. You know what? I gotta go. Yeah, you gotta go. That's what they all say, you gotta go. No, I told you, he doesn't like it if I've been down your here... Your boyfriend? Yes, he doesn't like it if I've been down here longer than I said I'd be, and I've been down here longer than I said I'd be. Ow! Oh my god, Ow. I can't believe I did that to you again! I'm Ow. so sorry! Wait, what did you just say?